Welcome back to the Daily 3 Minute Gains. I'm Kevin with Gains Healthy Ways, and we're about to rock out a nice stretch workout today. And the reason why we are doing a stretch workout today because I was suffering, guys, this past year in my, my 30s. I was like, man, well, I got hurt. I hurt my AC joint. I tore my AC joint in my shoulder skating at the skate park. I tore that real bad. I broke my finger a month later here. Let's see. You guys check out my finger. It's like totally not right. So yeah, that's like not cool. Anyway, so that's my finger a month later. My shoulder, I don't know if you could probably still see it. It's like, like that bump right there. That's my AC joint still popped out. So we're still working and dealing with that. But I did notice other things between me working as a plumber that, yo, like once you get to your 30s, like you start to feel a little bit more tight and your body goes through a little bit more aches and pains. Oh, I did pull my back a little bit playing basketball. I'm feeling better from that. But let me tell you, I can only say that stretching has been my route of getting back at it. And I, I actually am going to start working on actually watching some other trainers and learning from other trainers as well with stretching guys because it has been one of my weaknesses throughout my life and I want to get as sharp as I could so I can teach you guys everything I can. So I am going to go through some of those stretches that I have been doing that's been helping me over the past little bit that's been, yeah, just helping me and I'm going to hopefully learn a lot more that I can go through with you guys that we can really get this, uh, get our bodies feeling right and just really to have good mobility. I just turned 31 on um, Monday, uh, May 29th, on Memorial Day. So, what I have as a goal this year is to be, is actually on my list of goals, is to become more flexible. So, we are gonna rock out a lot of, uh, I hope I can just teach you guys a lot of new stuff and just, I get really sharp for you guys. That's my whole goal. Anyways, I'm gonna shut up, because I never shut up. Here we go. Please hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. We do get these workouts in every single day. So please stay tuned. We get like just different varieties so we have something for everyone. All right guys, we're gonna start off just breathing in and then breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out. Now, okay guys, I had some snapping hip syndrome going on. So that was definitely a pain uh, right on my inner groin and uh, it took some research, but some good stretches have been helping me with that. Uh, one thing that you guys could do is find like a chair or something you can put your, your leg up on, your foot up on, and you guys are just gonna work stretching that hip flexor out and sinking that hip down, getting your back leg straight, and we're just right here, okay? A lot of us know this stretch, a lot of us can do this, you can also lean up with your arms, and then what you can do is you can have your arms at your chest pretty much level, and you just turn over and really sink in and open up that hip. Really get that hip feeling nice and open that up right in the hip flexor area. All right, here we go. Now we're going to turn to the other side. This will also help with our back. All right. You can reach up as we are doing this. Really get a good deep stretch what we're doing here. Reaching up just like that. We can also do it from the ground just like this as so. And bringing it up, bringing it up. All right, this one will really help with that inner um, hip and really just get that side. Sias muscle feeling good. It's called the sias muscle in there that I am struggling with. So anyways, we're gonna open up this right side really quick. Since you guys, I did the left side. You know, I wanna make sure my body is nice and even. All right. Here we go, lean in. This is feeling great already. All right, I wish I had more time with you guys. We'd be really sitting in these deep, real good stretches. All right, guys. Um, let me hit this real quick. Boom, bang. All right. Lifting it. Lifting it. More of a dynamic stretch there, y'all. But I still got to go to the gym today, so I'm going to be moving around. We're going to get it. All right, guys. The next one is, I hope you guys can see me. If not, I'll adjust. 
but uh, my back is feeling goofy and stuff. I did find this one online. This one helped me out a lot. I will tag this video in the description. You take your door. Can you see my door? You can see the door. I'm gonna turn it a little bit. He did it on a door frame, but I am gonna do it on the door handles. I feel comfortable on the door handles. And you're gonna take it, cross it on the doorknob. Make sure that your feet are touching the, the foot of the, the door so you don't slide out. All right, and then you're just gonna sit your butt back and you're gonna let your back muscles just stretch out and over. And let me tell you guys, I do this at work on the studs and the bays. Um, a lot of times this will just like, oh my goodness, <clears throat> hold on. Woo! That felt amazing, that's why I had to stop. Um, and just like pretty much I can feel my back, just everything just completely just like goes back to me. Good, all right? And then as we are doing this in the video, if you would say it, you want to lean back and stretch out just like this. I forgot the reason, but let me tell y'all. Let me tell y'all. Really sink in. I've been putting my head, alright guys, this wasn't in the video, I didn't see, at least maybe I didn't pay attention, but I've been putting my head into my arms, staying neutral though, and really getting that stretch, that's been helping me tremendously get that extra couple cracks in, and really, it feels like a good stretch, so make sure you guys are leaning back after like that, and those are just a few stretches that have been really helping me uh, a lot, and my back, my hips, and my knees, I've been doing a lot more stretches with my legs, just like this, crossing over, going for the back heel, making sure. If you guys are dealing with plantar fasciitis, I'm so bad at saying stuff like that. A good stretch to do, guys, is stretching out those calf muscles. Make sure you guys stretching out those calf muscles all the time because that is what is tightening up the bottom of your guys' foot. So just a fun fact, you guys are having problems with that. Um, I am definitely out of time. Uh, I got stuff to do. I got studying I got to do. Uh, I'm getting ready to take my plumbing test in the next few months. So I'm one from one thing on to the next. But uh, I definitely plan on building so much more with you guys. And I'm just so excited to share all these daily three minute gains. And I can't wait to see all of you guys reach all of your goals. And I hope that I can do this to help you. And I know if you guys put God first, that will happen and you guys put those goals and just take them and strive. Let's go.